Hey, this is Anthony Davis, and this is a Research Minute. We're going to quickly summarize a paper for you. Hope you can read it, but if not, here are the good bits. This paper is called Mindset Matters, Exercise and the Placebo Effect. Basically, they were just trying to find out if changing a person's beliefs about their lifestyle could make them healthier without having them actually change their exercise, diet, lifestyle, etc. So they looked at hotel workers, they looked at 84 women, and all they did was for one group of them, they just told them that, hey, what you're doing, changing the sheets, changing the beds, uh, walking around the hotel, you do that every day anyway, and what you're doing already meets or exceeds the Surgeon General's recommendations for daily exercise. Uh, the other group of women were not told this encouraging information. Well, after only four weeks, what they found was that the subjects in the informed group lost an average of two pounds, they lowered their systolic blood pressure by 10 points, and they were significantly healthier as measured by body fat percentage, BMI, and waist to hip ratio. So just knowing that they were doing good things already for their health without having to change anything about their lifestyle, they actually showed improvements in many different markers of overall health. Yes, the gains were small, so this isn't the whole picture and this isn't a fix all, but your attitudes and beliefs do impact your overall health. And maybe, just maybe, thinking that you're healthy actually does make you a little bit healthier. Uh, for healthcare practitioners and uh, students like myself, I would my takeaway is simply that focusing on what a person is already doing well and encouraging them about that and just telling them they're doing a good job might actually impact their health more than trying to berate them and tell them you're not doing enough, you really need to exercise more, you really need to change your diet, otherwise you're gonna get this disease and blah, blah, blah. So be positive. Um, comment below, read the paper if you can, and tell us what you think. All right, that's it. See you next time.